Hello and welcome to the tutorial on addition. In this tutorial we will learn how to add four digit numbers and tens and we're going to begin with the horizontal format. So let's have a look at our first example. A comma. So we've got 3627 plus 30. 3627, notice the sign, plus 30. So how can we do this? Well first we have to look at the second number, 30, and look at the units over here. It's 0. And because it's 0, the unit over here, 3627, the 7, is not going to change. Okay, that's the first important point. The second part is the tens. We've got three tens here and two tens here. Two plus three equals five. As for the thousands and the hundreds, in this example, they will not change. Okay, they're going to remain the same. So the answer then becomes three thousand. 657. The only digit in this example which has changed is the tens. Now that's not always the case. In fact we're going to move on to one which is a little bit different. This time we've got 5348 plus 80. Okay, this one is slightly different. 5,348 plus 80. Now there is more than one way to do this. What we're going to do is break it down for each digit. Okay, We're adding 80, which means that we've got the units over here and we've got the tens. Okay, On the left hand side we've got the units We've got, I'll just keep changing colors, we've got tens, we've got hundreds, and we've got thousands. So let's add them as if we were doing them mentally, okay, instead of trying to work everything out. So we start with the thousands, over here, five. Now the five is not going to change. Five remains five thousand. We'll write that down. Now let's move on to the hundreds. We've got 3. It's adding to 0 at the moment, so therefore that's just 300. Now we're going to add the tens. We've got 4 here and we've got 8 over here. What is 4 plus 8? Equals 12. So we can write this down. 1, 2, and don't forget the 0 because we're adding, sorry, because that is tens, okay? 4 plus 8 is 12 and the 0 because we're adding tens. And lastly, we're going to add the units. We've got 8 plus 0, so that remains 8. Okay, so what is the answer? We simply add these numbers together. We've got 5,000, the 3 and the 1 becomes 428. Now you're probably thinking this is actually a long way to work it out. But mentally, this is the way to work it out. You start off on the left-hand side, start with the thousands. You say 5,000 over here. Then you say 300. So 5,300, but you're adding 4 to the 8. Okay? So that becomes 120. So 5,300 becomes 5,420. And then you've simply got the 8 at the end. 5,428. With a bit of practice, you'll be able to do this without any workings. Okay, let's have a look at one more. Okay, this time we've got 8,883 plus 50. 8,883 plus 50. Okay, this time I'm going to work this out as if we were doing this 
mentally. So we've got 8,000 to begin with. So that's what I'm, my starting point, 8,000. Then we've got 800, okay, 8,800. Next, I'm going to add the 8 to the 5, okay? We're adding the 10s. 8 plus 5 is 13, but don't forget the 0 at the end, okay? So that becomes 130 because we're adding 10s. So 8,800 then suddenly becomes 8,900, okay? 8,900 because of this 1 over here. And then we've got 30, 8,930. The last number we need to add is the 3 and the 0, which is 3. So the answer then becomes 8,933. Now again, I did that rather quickly and all in one color. But you have a practice with this. You've got 8,000, then 8,800, you add the 8 and the 5 is 13, so it becomes 8,900. Okay, 8,900, and you've got the 30 because 8 plus 5 is 13. And lastly, you're going to add the 3. So it becomes 8,933. I mean, it looks more complicated than it is. Have a practice with a few numbers, four-digit numbers and tens, and I promise you, after a period of time, a short period of time, you'll be able to do these mentally. So that is the addition of four-digit numbers and tens in the horizontal format.